I just learned something new, so I wanted to share that with you. Recently, I got a brand new sublimation printer, the Epson Surecolor F170, and I was very excited to make a mug with my new printer. After I posted that video, I was looking at my mug and I'm like, the color looks a little off, it looks a little darker. So I made a few more mugs and also realized that those mugs, the ink was appearing darker. So I set out to find what I did wrong and I figured it out. So maybe you're having the same problem, maybe your colors are looking a little darker, so I'm going to show you how to fix that. For reference, I am using an iMac computer. I size my images using Canva, and then I downloaded those files as a PNG, and then I open up that file and print directly from my iMac. So here's what you need to do. So here's the image I want printed. We're going to go up to File and down to Print. First, make sure you've selected the right printer. Mine is on my inkjet printer. I'm going to switch that to my Epson SureColor printer. And then we're going to scroll down to printer options and then select color matching. Now, this is what I did wrong last time. I left this section selected as Epson color controls, but what we need to do is go over to color sync. Now you'll have a drop down menu here and you'll be able to select either textile or rigid. So textile is like your fabrics, like a pillowcase or a t-shirt and rigid is like your harder objects, like a tumbler or a mug. So I'm doing this project on a mug, so we're going to select rigid and then click on OK. Now, once again, under printer options, we need to go to print settings. And under media type, make sure this is also selected to rigid, unless you're doing a textile, which you would select textile for. And you'll notice that mirror image is checked and that's what we want. And then you can press OK and then have your printer print out your image and you should have the right colors. So this is the very first mug I made using the Epson Color F170. And you can see it looks amazing. It has vibrant, bright colors, but this isn't the same color as I had on my screen. And it looks a little more pinky, maybe a little red, and my color on the screen was more of a purple color. And when I made this mug, the only setting I changed was under print settings. I didn't switch the color matching setting. So after I switched the color matching setting and remade this mug, this is what it looks like. So you can tell this one is more accurate to the screen colors, it's purple not pink. Both mugs look fantastic, but this was the color I was going for. I hope this video helped you. If you're interested in crafting tutorials, be sure to subscribe, and I hope to see you on another crafting adventure.